so um, yeah, he's my great grandfather was was a uh, sugar worker, and in those days, of course, you had to you were a contract worker, and uh, you not only had to pay for your transportation to Hawaii, but you also had to pay for rent and food and all of that good stuff before you actually got net pay. And uh, I think he was there, I'm not sure exactly how long his contract was for, but at least three years, three to five years, I believe. And um, he actually was working uh, on the Big Island. Uh, after whatever time it took for him to at least pay off the transportation part of it, he then um, left the plantation. I, I don't know if it was legal or not, but he, <laughs> he left because he knew that was, uh, that was uh, too difficult a way of making a living. So he then um, uh, was a stowaway on a boat from uh, the Big Island to Maui. And uh, when he was uh, there on Maui, he went to the old, uh, there was a hotel called the Pioneer Inn there, and somehow convinced the owner to hire him and train him as a bartender. And so he actually started, uh, you know, started as a bartender there, and he learned most of his English there, and he got to see how people interacted, and he overheard, obviously, a lot of interesting conversations especially in a bar <laughs> where people say things they wouldn't say anywhere else. 